The first thing I usually ask an athlete is, do you really need to lose your body fat? Is that what um, is hindering your performance gains? Because one of the things that's unavoidable is the fact that by reducing the amount of food you have in your diet, your recovery or your performance are going to suffer, which means that you might not improve as much as you would otherwise. So it's a really, really important uh, for you to actually see whether you need to lose your body mass or not in the first place. But if you decide that your body mass is um, the limitation to your performance gains, then you need to look at your training plan and see before which training sessions you can actually reduce the amount of food you have in your diet. So before easy training sessions, so this is zone one and zone two, you probably don't need to eat as much carbohydrates. So you can avoid those carbohydrates a bit, so reduce the amount. Keep the protein intake very high um, and reduce the fat intake as well. You don't really need a lot of fat um, in a day. You can go with 0.8 to one gram per kilogram body mass of fat a day, but What's crucial is that you retain a very high carbohydrate availability for harder training sessions. So you still eat plenty of carbs before those training sessions and straight after to recover. Otherwise, you will end up not recovering well or failing those, those training sessions, which can uh, be detrimental to your uh, long-term performance goals.